Welcome back guys to the Weeps Closet and today we're watching Cyberpunk Edge Runners Lucky You episode 4. Uh, last episode we were introduced to the rest of the cyberpunks. Um, Dorio I think it had the blue aesthetic. We had Pillar, which makes sense. He's the guy with the long arms or whatever. That makes sense. We got Kiwi, was the girl that was in pink. Main, I think that's his name. Yeah, Main is the main dude that we have. And obviously, we got Becca or Rebecca, which is the tiny lolly that everybody talks about. Or, or not everybody, but I guess a lot of anime fans talk about it. Because uh, not many people that watch anime know... Not many people that don't watch anime know what a lolly is, so... There you go. We kind of understand now why uh, Lucy uh, backstabbed this other dude, uh, David. And uh, now David is in a spot where I low-key think he likes where he's at. It's a matter of uh, now he's pushed against the wall and now he has to do all these other things until he is not only somebody that needs to pay back what he has, but rather just he's there because he wants to be and everybody else who wants them there rather than just like uh, kind of like a ransom until you don't pay off you cannot leave uh so yeah no i'm excited the team has gone crazy i love the fight uh, david was actually kicking ass for the little bit that he could do uh, lucy was amazing fighting and but anyways uh with that said guys Check our Twitter, check our Twitch. Mike is streaming from time to time on the weekend, so by all means, check that out. Uh, eventually, we'll join him in streaming. It's, we're just busy with videos, so by all means. But uh, if you want to catch up with a lot of different shows, go ahead and check our Patreon. From the moment you join our Patreon, you get access to the uncuts of all the different shows that we've done, as well as access to our Discord, where you get to chat with us or amongst yourselves about any games, shows, or movies. If you choose to jump into our Weep Titan tier, you'll have access to our time exclusive shows. These shows will either be ahead or unavailable to watch in our YouTube. Attack on Time used to be there, Jujutsu Kaisen just finished, Mob Cycle is starting, and Invincible has been over there for over a year. And for the Full Metal Weeps, not only do you get shown off here, but you get one week early access to the shows currently on the screen, as well as staying ahead into our bi-weekly podcast, and you also get to vote and watch our monthly Anka movie. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and let's start the video. Is this like a dream? Is this the middle of a fight or something? Or training? Oh God, what happened? Like, unfortunately this cannot be training because I really doubt that they can afford blowing shit up and calling attention to themselves. So I really doubt that this is the case. I, I already downloaded like four songs from here, but granted, Cyberpunk had these songs before this show had them, but uh, I've been listening to a couple of them, especially the, the one that has the long title that was the one playing whenever him and Lucy were in the moon. Oh, wait. I remember it was blue, but... God damn. <laughs> I wouldn't fight it. I'm like, yeah, whatever. Rude motherfucker. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that's what I like to see. Put some respect on my name, buddy. Oh shit. What the fuck? That's probably why people were like fucking simping over this girl. Mm. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. It's just fucking getting upgraded. Yeah, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Dimples. That's funny. <laughs> I love David. He's so like enthusiastic about this. I don't blame him. Oh yeah, I don't. He has to be. 
サイバーパンクになるには貧相ねインプラントはあと一つか二つつけたらサイバーサイコになっちゃうそこまでなんじゃくじゃねえ I mean, don't you need somebody that looks relatively normal in order to get into certain, certain places, though? Oh my god, this girl is fucking built. Ooh, that's pretty fucking cool. Whoa, girl, calm down. <laughs> Getting into trouble and shit. Mm. I like that. You know, he, he does bring a good point. Isn't that rude to be asking, buddy? You don't ask a woman her age. Although that she's probably 72, 12. It doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> Whenever you can keep like giving yourself like upgrades, you don't age technically. Hmm, what the fuck's going on here? That's fucking cool. Kind of reminds me of Matrix almost. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's pretty fucking cool. I have to say, these these are <laughs> fucking idiot. Holy shit, this girl has. I wonder if she has like auto target with her eyes, because that's technically an implement that you can do. So like, pop up and you already know where you're gonna aim. Oh yeah, these people. I forgot the name, but like, cause I only had one mission with him before. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Oh my God. That's so fucking crazy. Yeah, like that's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like she found something in him and whatever. I don't think she's necessarily liking what he's turning into though. I feel like, if anything, she kind of likes the idea of him being kind of innocent in this world, but also wants him to have enough experience to defend himself if, if possible. <laughs> yeah, he's actually old, isn't it? <laughs> so funny. Hmm, I don't think... I want to say that he's probably a psycho, uh... What the first guy had. Oh! I forgot that this is how he began. It was too late, man. That's fucking crazy. It's like, what do you do? Like, he's still in panic mode. Yeah, I knew that Becca was gonna fucking. Yeah. Woo! Crazy to show you that. Holy shit. Where the fuck does she keep all these guns? Oh my god. So they already have a program for everybody. Like, I guess, every, like, she's prone to go berserk. Just fucking blow him up. Blow him up. Like, yeah. No. Oh. Lucio,リパーのとこにでも連れてけ。じゃ、デイビッド。あとは頼んだよ。お、お、お、おい。メインが車使っていいってさ。うん。
Oh my god, such a bad... I mean, don't get me wrong, Pillar wasn't like that amazing of a character, but like, he's part of the crew, right? I love this, uh, sh like, shot is pretty good. あんたは良い裁判判官になれると思う。サイドンワンチュドゥ。この世界で名を残す方法はどう生きるかじゃない。どう死ぬかよ。俺と大して変わらないだろ。私は他に居場所がない。いや、for such a beautiful shot. Ah, oh, that's amazing. I'm not gonna lie, I'm like tearing up here. And they fucking ended here, you son of a bitch. Ah, oh, I'm all up for that lovey dovey shit. Don't do this shit to me. Ah, I need more. I need more of the relationship, man. See, I okay. So it is that. It's not. I. I that's what I thought it was. Like I thought that's where she was trying to head towards with her thought process of like, I just don't want you to be an edge runner. Because ultimately, like, yeah, she's saying it's like any cyberpunks or whatever. It's it's all about how you go out, and that's what defines you as a cyberpunk. Problem is. Once you make it good as a cyberpunk, that means that you no, you're no longer here. And it does make sense, because if you think about it, you're not the best at something because people know you. You're the best because people don't even know that you're coming. Pause on that. And that's why what she was talking about. It's like, I don't want you to die on me because like, and I don't want you to be an edge runner because of the fact that, you know, that means that I won't have you. And I love that. I, I I love that. I, uh, man. See, and that's what I was saying. I, I know for a fact that she kind of picked up on it. And, and she kind of, uh, the same conversation that I had, outcasts recognizes outcasts. And, and you know, and you have that he like kind of feeling towards that other person. And it's crazy. Man, like, I, I'm a sucker. I'm a sucker for relationship stuff. It's for, like for any kind of couples or whatever in shows. I love it. I, I like Becca a lot, too. Because... Holy shit, I said that Lucy was the, the jinx of the show. I may have to switch it to Becca. Becca was fucking ridiculous. It's it's to the point that she's kind of like reckless slash relentless. Whereas Lucy is reckless but calculated almost. It's like it's it's an odd uh contra like a uh, contradiction, right? Like she doesn't bite more than she can chew, where Becca doesn't even care if it's the whole cow. And she's taking it down. And it's so funny that her team knows this to the point that it's like, activate the lullaby, just make her go to sleep. That's fucking insane. I like it. And the fact that it's funny because kind of Kiwi, it's kind of like the mom of the group. That was crazy. And David freezing. Like, there's so much to talk about in this episode because this episode, I, I stayed quiet for the longest because there was just so much happening. And David being um, like shook. I don't blame him. I think that would be, be me too. Because I think what will be going through my head is the idea of like, I was there, I was seeing it happen and I didn't respond quickly enough to activate it to get him out of the way. And I think that's what's running in his brain, like on loop on those milliseconds because he activated it, but nothing happened out of it. And it's just because of that, like the shock, just like kept repeating that non nonstop in his head until main just kick the living shit out of out of the way to <laughs> save his ass i expected him to get shot as well to kind of poke at the fact that you need to start getting some uh some chrome on you some cybernetics on you uh he has now the lungs which is crazy to think so i mean it's a cool improvement right like it's it, let me let me be able to be more athletic by just having this like my body stays the same it's just this that is limiting me so let me go ahead and change it to last longer Pause on that. uh problem is that like if he does that with let's say his art the moment that he gets shocked his heart may just stop forever so that's something to be careful with like that wouldn't be my first change at all 
Uh, but man, no, I'm loving it. I'm I'm fucking loving it. this show. Is fucking insane. Uh, and I'm over here cursing like a sailor. And I apologize for the little kids, but you honestly should be of age if you're watching this. Uh, let's be honest. And second of all, man, like this show holds no punches. I love it. I want to see more. So hope you guys enjoyed because I definitely did. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching another Weeps Closet reaction. And a special thanks to our Patreons for keeping this channel going. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and we'll see you in the next one.